One of the things we do during the holidays is watch a lot of television, especially football, and that is precisely the activity that can get really expensive if you aren't paying attention. Yeah, Local 4 Business Editor Rob Maloney has some year-end financial advice surrounding the services we buy and often set and forget, and that lack of attention can get unnecessarily expensive. All right, it is confession time. A couple of years ago, I went out and bought a cable package that had a landline phone in it. It was really inexpensive, but I didn't pay attention. And so we went to cut the cord a couple of weeks ago and discovered that we've been paying 30 bucks a month for a phone line I couldn't tell you the number to and we never even used. So that's a big reminder for us all that we need to shop our services regularly. The services we're discussing here range from your cell phone, TV streaming service, all the way up to your auto and homeowners or renters insurance. Nationally known personal finance writer Brian O'Connor says we all have a story. I had a friend uh, who was still getting Cat Fancy magazine two years after his cat died. He advises taking the hour or two every six months or so to pick up the phone and negotiate. The best thing about that is that you're saving that money. If you take a $12 subscription out of there, you're saving that money every month for the rest of the year. It's like you just gave yourself 144 bucks. Did I mention everyone has a story? Certified financial planner Rick Kaler says he recommends this to all of his clients. I had one client that did this and it was $300 a month that he was able to save. So it's important. Rick even sets reminders on his own phone. My Sirius XM uh, subscription, it was going from $5 to $30. And um, I was a, a few days late. I saw that this had happened. I called him. And after a little bit of uh, talking, we got that back down, I think, to $7. Those are smaller numbers, but how about insurance? Auto, home, life, there's plenty of savings to be had. And certified financial planner Julie Quick of Cultivating Financial Wellness says shopping premiums is a benefit, but shopping for more and better coverage is even more important. If your wages have finally started to increase with inflation, making sure that the life insurance that you have to protect your family is sufficient to, um, to replace your income. Same with homeowners insurance. Um, you know, even though we've experienced um, higher in interest rates, um, housing prices have not really come down all that much. When it comes to insurance, remember you're shopping for need, okay? So in a high inflation, high interest rate area where home values are up, it could be that you don't have enough replacement coverage on your home and you don't want to come up short in an emergency. You need to shop that. But then there is also the question of life insurance. You got wife, kids, home, mortgage, all of that stuff. That's a big need. If you're single and retired, you probably don't have as large a need, but you've got to shop all of this. One of the best ways to go about it is to talk to a fee based certified financial planner. Happy New Year. Rod Maloney, Local 4. And Rod says the best way to attack this problem is to take the time and pull out your monthly bills and look at the itemized charges. Then, especially with cable or cell phone plans, call and ask for ways to save money. Now, he's linked some helpful reading on clinkontetroit.com to give you some additional help.